All right, so we're going to teach you real quick and show you how um, to set up the exercise video database. So uh, you need three tabs open. You need your YouTube uh, thing open. We need to sign in to the uh, Squarespace backend. So when you go sign into Squarespace, you go to Pages. Um, but I'm going to scroll down. I can scroll down here. And we need to make some great it's slow we need to make a new um, I can say the blog feature we need to make that for each one of these video breakdowns so snatch clean jerk squat so I've already made one for the snatch video so we're gonna now go into the clean video and I'm gonna show you how to do that so we start off by the not linked will uh, all that means is that it doesn't appear in this but it will uh, appear in search engines so you click that, you're going to have to click the blog feature. What a blog, we'll type in clean videos. Uh, just follow that kind of format of just what it is upper body video, clean videos, just so we know what it is. So you get that there. Um, so now that that page is made, you can start creating posts, i.e., which will be your uh, exercises. But real quick, before we get to that, is I'm going to back up here and we're going to go into the show you how I made the summary list so if you look here on the snatch video part uh, the summary list all that entails is it's a listing and it's pulling from any of our posts that we made our post that I made this the, the snatch video ie that like blog and they changed the name what we just did um, it's pulling all the recent posts and I'll show you how to kind of order them. Uh, you can change the dates on all these to kind of maneuver it so it's kind of like alphabetical order. So what we're going to do here is you're going to clean videos and when you do all the others the same way we will go through and this is how it kind of was in the preset. We're going to edit so you just kind of hover over and you can edit the contents and you'll see here that there's boxes and if you just kind of hover you'll see these little I don't know these like teardrop shaped things and this will show you that if you create if you click here whatever you do will be put in this area right so that whole line whatever you put there will appear across the whole white thing if you want it to be on the side so we're just gonna kinda do the whole white thing because we're gonna be able to do it so you click here and you have a bunch of different options like, oh, you can go with text box, markdown box, quote box, images, videos you need to go down to um, the summary, and sometimes the slider doesn't work, so you just kind of kind of click and hold, and you can highlight, and then you can figure it out. But the slider on this one isn't working. But you're going to click the list, and you can see now that you have three options to choose from. So you're going to click the clean video because you're in clean videos, clean video. So now it's going to be pulling from that. Um, you can go to layout. I believe the standard is what we're look. Uh, I believe it's 30. It may be 40. Let me go check after this, and we'll come back to it. But just make sure you watch this whole thing. So that's good. So to display, we want to show more read link, show expert. Yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna say, put them all up there. Somebody's in there. They want to scroll. They can scroll through. So you got 30. Um, I don't want to put the date posted because that's not really a big deal for this. So click none for there none now we got to do the category filter um, all that means is when we do the category filter so when you tag something we want to make sure that it's um, tagged correctly so we're gonna apply the category filter and it's gonna go into uh, we want to put clean video so now you're only gonna show um, videos when you do your videos and you're publishing that post when you click the category it will be under clean video so now when you do you know the snatch videos I tag them as snatch so now it's only recognizing and pulling from those categories um, so oh my gosh it's Tuesday morning one cup of coffee so we'll apply. All right, just to recheck this here. Display. Right, 
down. Oh, so sorry, we're going to do this. Uh, clean video is going to go in the tag filter. This is going to be video library. And I'll show you how that works. I apologize for my slowness today. This is just not working for me right now. Um, all right, so don't worry about show feature. Don't click that. So you apply it. So what we're going to do is we save it, and we're not going to back out of here. And we're going to go down and we'll start creating uh, posts. I'm going to go to shop. So. As you guys know, my biggest pet peeve is slow internets. Mm -hmm. All right, so you go to clean videos. See, it's blank. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to our YouTube channel and you're gonna go to video manager. And in the video manager, you can search through all our videos. So we just wanna look up clean. So the biggest thing here is uh, we do have a lot of videos on here, but a lot of them aren't really brand standard in terms of good lighting, good, uh, you know, if we look at the more recent ones we've been doing are definitely good, but if we look at some of the other ones, um, we do, we have better ones here. Like I wouldn't put this one in there. Um, I wouldn't put that one in there. I wouldn't put that one in there. These could potentially be in there. That's a great breakdown. Um, you know, so we'll kind of go through, uh, you know, obviously if we have multiples of the same, pick the best one. But the biggest thing we're looking for is it's got to be good lighting. It has to be good angles. Uh, if we could have a couple angles, so like a couple of these, um, for instance, this one right here, it's a good video, uh, but it's just, I think we have better ones in there that you've made. Uh, so we'll go through there. So let's just start off. Um, We'll go with the muscle. So you can click it, and then I'm just going to pause it so it so I can start to get it. So we want to just tag everything. Don't worry about all that. You're just going to type in muscle clean for your first post. So go to click, and type in muscle clean. Don't worry about alphabetizing right now. Um, so anyone, you can click here. We're going to click video. We'll have to copy the URL. So you can copy it from the top toolbar. You can also scroll down and you can find it. Click show more. I'm sorry, click share. And that's, you'll copy and paste that. And then we just take that URL, we put it into here. It's gonna bring it up. Um, so we wanna make sure we first, if there's anything in here, you wanna copy it and then delete it. We're gonna use that later. You wanna get rid of that custom toolbar so nothing, see if it's on, it will have something up here on the video. You wanna get rid of that. So you just click there, do not display caption, apply. So now uh, how our layout is, we have like a brief summary. What this does is this is pulling, uh, when we have the blog post on the main page, it sees. So you wanna click above, it had that solid black line up there. You wanna click text. Um, if you copied something prior, you can just copy and paste it. So this tells you a little bit about muscle clean is a perfect preliminary blah, blah, blah. Great. From there, we then go down here to the full line. You're going to click another text. Um, so you click in here. We use header three with a bold. And we start with all caps, execution. And then you can go down. It's on normal again. We want to unbold. And then this is where we can type how to do it. Um, sometimes the bold, you can see it's still bold, so you gotta highlight it, unbold it, and then oddly enough, it didn't really work, so you can kinda delete it and then go at it. Um, then you can finish there. Um, then you're just gonna go back down underneath. And there's another text box. So, the next one here is purpose. So once again, um, purpose. I just forgot to highlight it. I mean, bold it up. So we'll go header three, bold, beautiful. All right. 
and then we'll unbolt this sucker still so my computer's kind of wanky sometimes um, and we'll type in all there and then your last one we want to go is programming essentially all that means is how would somebody put this in their in their programming so maybe give them some percentages that they can use how many rep schemes is typically used with um, and then there's your text forgot to highlight it bold heading number three and then one more that we've been doing here is the C also and this is a great way to just add some embedded links so maybe if it's a muscle clean maybe you say C also the clean the power clean um, snatch grip high pull you know like pick three things that are going to go along with it um, and that's essentially how you're going to do this so when you do that some cool things here is as we start building this sucker out we can actually, you know, so the muscle clean variation, you know, after the second pull. So you can start to kind of insert some tag words into there. So maybe it's, uh, you know, by negating the ability to reflex under the bar for the second pull, you develop more mechanics. You can somehow try and work in there, um, you know, similar to your snatch grip high pull. And then you can highlight that snatch grip high pull and you can... Uh, make that a backlink to another one of the posts that is natural high pole so now people are just trafficking through our site um, so before you save and publish here we need to go into your options and we need to get a picture and we need to make sure this is a clean post URL so whatever you have put up through here you just want to copy it real quick and you want to paste that in the excerpt so on the main screen this is what somebody's going to see um, how we're going to get the image, I can do this if you don't have a Mac, you just need to let me know. Um, we're going to go back to your YouTube. It gets a little trickier. So you can screenshot on Macs using the Command, Shift, and 4 button. Um, so we're going to play it. And then we just want to make sure that that black screen is blank. Command, Shift, and 4. I'm going to highlight the whole screen. And you just want to take some form of a picture there. I just took a picture. So then what we'll do is it's a screenshot, but it's a fine picture. You're going to go back to your clean videos. You're going to upload an image. Um, and we'll go down to our most recent screenshot here, which is the one I just took, uh, which is this one. We'll choose it. And it should compress and resize. So there you go. So it doesn't need to be a great image. It's an action shot. It is what it is. So now that we have that, we finished the title. We finished this. We've you know typed in all the execution, the options. We have the tag here. So now I want to look at how to what do we put here? Um, the clean videos that stays because that's the that's the file it's in. So we're just going to put muscle hyphen snatch so if it was power snatch it'd be power hyphen snatch you know if it was uh, snatch high pull it'd be snatch hyphen high snatch and pull whatever it is author we can really just put jade fit here once we start putting a post this is also how you're going to change your post your blog post um, you know when you're writing about whatever so you're going to save and publish once it's saved and publish it's in there it's out so just to kind of see where we're at with things uh, we'll go to pages here and we'll navigate up top and we'll look at uh, what ours looks like. So go to the clean and clean videos, our library. Hmm, odd. Oh, so perfect. This is actually good to happen. So it's not pulling anything, right? Even though we published, not pulling anything. What I didn't do is I didn't add um, a tag or a category so it's not going to filter it correctly so remember when we put up in this area how I said I want to make sure that I put uh, what is it, clean videos so we edit here and I forgot to add the tag at the bottom and this should fix it so we look tags down here the category we said uh, you can see we'll create category video library oh, I don't want to caps Oh. 
You gotta make sure you push enter afterwards. Okay. Gosh darn it, I'm sorry. Oh. Cool, so we added it. And then we're gonna go to tags, and we're gonna type in clean videos. Enter. Cool. So now we're done. Comments can be on. So now it's tagged under clean videos video library. So anything that is tagged with these tags here is going to get recognized. We'll save it by our summary list that we put on the main clean page. So if we go back in, scroll up top, we should have our first clean video posted. And obviously, I didn't finish the execution programming for the sake of this demonstration. But let's see what's going on in here. Go figure, it works a million times, and then I'm trying to show you here. Um, so, how do we troubleshoot this? We've got clean video selected, good. Let's go to display and see what's not picking up. Oh, clean video, I need clean videos. It recognizes it, perfect. Apply it. Bada bing, bada boom. So when somebody goes in and we have a huge list, they click on it, it will take them to that individual post page that they can hang out on there. Um, so we're going to just get rid of these because we're going to actually just make our own custom thing. Um, however, you want to make sure that you keep the make your training list playlist. Um, and just make sure that if the videos, if they're not good quality, don't put them up. Or, you know, if they're not us performing them well, we all have bad reps. Let's not put them up. Let's make sure that we put our best foot forward. Um, so you can leave that down there. That way people can actually make it. I love this idea. Great way to do it. So we save it, and we're ready to go. That is how you're going to do it. Um, so when somebody clicks it, They'll get redirected. They'll go to our Muscle Clean post page where they can hang out on here and they can, um, you know, they can go down. We'll type in execution, purpose, programming, yada, yada, yada. Uh, real quick, once you start going, so because it's a post type, um, the order that you make them is the order that they're going to be in. However, we want to make sure that we can alphabeticalize them. So how you're going to do that is you're simply just going to change the, the dates and obviously the most recent date is going to be the one that's going to appear at the top of the list. So you can kind of change the dates and time in an order so that it lays out how we need it. So to edit, you just go in to edit the date. Um, you know, say I had a power clean coming up. I need the power clean to actually appear after the muscle clean. And even though I already published this one, say I set this as 745 and I publish the other one at 743, this one will be more recent, so it will show up higher on the list. And because M comes before P, we'll be good to go. So you can just click this, and then you can it will show you, like, okay, where do you want to change it to? So that's that. That is how we're going to do this thing. All right. Um, I think I showed you everything. So you'll just need your YouTube page up. You can go back and forth here, and you can then, you know, filter through and see what we want to do. And, you know, like... All these guys, I wouldn't put all of them, I would just put the great ones, so uh, the ones we need, like three position, muscle, tall hang, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, um, barbell lift off, barbell high pull, um, we have a couple power cleans in here, power clean, push press, power clean, you know, you don't need all this labeling here, you know, power position and mid knee, so this is, okay, so that's a, that's a complex there. You know, I wouldn't put barbell power clean. You should put power clean in the, in the title when we get it. Um, yeah, you know, like, that's pretty much it. So we'll go through and we'll get it nasty. Cool. All right, take care. I'll see you. All right, stop recording.